The first step to getting booked with Visita is configuring your business hours and availability. We'll start by setting your account time zone settings. Select your time zone from the drop down. Enable the local time zone setting if all of your clients will be scheduling from the same time zone as you. This is usually the case if you operate a local business, like a hair salon or a local clinic. With this setting enabled, Visita will ignore time zones during scheduling. For now, we will not enable the local time zone setting. Finally, select your time format, either 12 or 24 hour format. Save your changes. Now, it's time to set up your business hours. We can do that in staff settings. By the way, you can set up all of your staff's availability from this page. For now, we will edit our own schedule. Switch to the My Schedule tab. If using time zones, the time zone can be customized per staff member. So if you have staff members in other locations, you can choose their time zone. If you have never edited your business hours before, you will find the default hours here. Go ahead and edit the time slots by clicking on the pencil icon. Here's a great idea. Give yourself a lunch break by breaking your day up into multiple slots. Let's end this slot at noon and save it. Click the plus button to add a new slot. We'll start this one an hour after the first one ended. This gives us an eight to five workday with an hour lunch in between. Customize the remainder of your workdays. As you can see, you can get as flexible as you want with your workday. But what if you want to come in on a specific date? For example, you want to work the coming Saturday without opening up availability on every Saturday. You can do that too. Vesita lets you set up date-specific availability. Click on the edit button to continue. Click and drag anywhere to create a new time slot. We're going to open up Saturday. In our example, we just open up some business hours on the upcoming Saturday. Clients will be able to schedule with you on this specific Saturday. Notice that the date-specific availability appears bright yellow compared to regular business hours. Similarly, if you want to change or remove your regular business hours on any specific day, click on the block to remove it and then create date-specific availability for the times that you would like to offer instead. This is a great option, for example, if your office will be closed on a specific day. Click Done to save your changes. Finally, if you have and use a third-party calendar, you will want to sync it to Vasita. Syncing your personal calendar to Vasita ensures that all of your personal appointments appear on your calendar, thus preventing clients from booking with you when you're busy. Select your calendar provider from the list and follow the instructions provided. We recommend syncing with Google Calendar for the best experience. You can hide the details of your personal calendar appointments using the checkbox. Don't worry, your clients will never see your personal appointment details either way. After setting up availability for your staff, you can optionally set up availability for specific services. Click on any service to customize its availability. You can open and close the service for booking on certain days or adjust the times. Keep in mind that the service specific availability will not override staff availability if you are on a multi-staff account. At least one staff member must be available to offer the service during extended hours. You can even add date specific availability for a service just like staff members. If you don't customize service availability, it will match the availability of the staff assigned to the service. Our availability is all set up. Let's take a look at our calendar. Your business hours are highlighted on the calendar. Over here is one of the events synced over from the Google Calendar we connected earlier. You can tell it's synced due to the sync indicator. By the way, if you need to edit or remove one of these blocks, you will need to edit it on your connected calendar. It can't be edited in Visita. Syncing from your calendar is a great way to block out busy time from scheduling. There is one more way to block time on the fly. Blocked off time. Click anywhere on the calendar and select blocked off time from the dropdown. This creates a block of busy time of default length. Click on it again to edit. As you can see, there are plenty of ways to create a personalized, flexible schedule in Visita, and we hope you avail yourself of all of them. Visit our Help Center to learn more at support.visita.com.